Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma Reviews. So today, it is a, another small independent business day. Oh my God, what the fuck was that? Sorry guys. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Enigma Review. So today I'm going to be doing another small independent business. One that actually contacted me. Um, it was kind, there's a kind of a story behind this and I'll quickly tell the story. So um, a lady called Amy was on my um, Instagram and I, I did wonder if it was the same Amy that was the owner of a certain business that I, Put on my list to try as you know i've got a lot of small independent businesses that i am ticking off some that i've done more than once more than twice some that i've never done and i want to do um and she had a pair of boots and i was like oh and i said where are them boots from because they were absolutely they were lovely and she said that they were from asos and they were truffle so I was like, oh, well, I, I I like truffle. I buy a lot of truffle shoes. They're cheap and cheerful. And these were like a dupe for New Rocks. Cut long story short, eventually I got these shoes and I messaged her and I said, I got the shoes, da, 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 da. And she even got the New Rocks, which were £25 from TK Maxx. Lucky, lucky sod, because I couldn't get my hands on them. And I ended up having a lot of sleepless nights. <laughs> um, so then she messaged me and said, I don't know if you, if you realise I'm Amy. I am the owner of Rebel um soul and i was like i did wonder <laughs> i did wonder and she asked me if i was interested in um a pr item and i was like oh yeah that'd be lovely thank you and it's maybe it's just me guys when somebody offers me pr i'm like i feel like i, I have to like buy things first from the shop before they give me pr and i know it, it probably doesn't work like that but um I had already got something marked down that I wanted to buy from Amy and I was actually going to buy it that week anyway because it was my small independent business trying to buy so many things with um, a small amount of money and I'd actually picked an item from Amy's store that I wanted anyway so I gave my address and, and I purchased an item and I said there's my address and she was like oh you, you didn't have to do that I was going to send you some PR anyway and I was like you know don't worry about it it's fine thank you for asking me and so forth and that was that so guys rebel soul um rebel soul she's been on Etsy since 2015 698 sales five star rating on Etsy of course all these people have five star ratings and I know why because they are absolutely amazing people um I don't think I've ever met anybody from small independent business that's rude and arrogant and I've, I've crossed wires with, you know, or fell out with or not been happy with. I just absolutely love them all. I think they're absolutely amazing people. I feel like we're a part of one big family and I'm a bit of a talker, guys. I like, I'm a, I'm a people's person. I like to communicate with people. And if I come across somebody who is not very forthcoming with me doesn't really want to chat with me I instantly think oh they don't like me and I, I actually feel that way about a lot of people I've met don't initially like me probably because they don't understand me as a person but I've always been that way I mean I worked in front house people you know I've worked in retail I've worked in beauty I've worked in office and admin I've worked front of house and I'm just that's just who I am so it's a variety themed jars I just got money saving memory box I think this is when I went right back into what she was doing um, but she takes custom orders guys personalized with names dates um, First a check, put on sign, no refunds after customise. So guys, if you've asked Amy to customise something and you decide, oh, I don't like it, I don't like the shape of the print or I don't like the colour or it's not the way I thought it'd be, tough. Once you've customised something, guys, you can't turn around and change your mind. It don't work like that. And I, I for one, I love customised items. I've had many customised items and I've, I've got to say I'm very grateful for what I've got and I'm happy with that. Now, uh, she's got vinyl on frames as well, guys. Um, prices from seven to six pounds to five pounds signs. 
um, she's got on frame prints at six pound hanging decorations from seven pound upwards planchette six pound oh she's got some amazing amazing acrylic items guys I could have had it all and I've just been written down me 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 <laughs> so I think Amy knows that I'll be back in her shop very soon um, but she does a variety of items from gothic tattoo style gifts and uh, it says not limited to any theme frames can take up to two weeks to dispatch um perfect um, i was quite happy to wait for my parcel i'm not the type of person that will like oh i've waited two days that's that's too long or oh, i've waited six days that's too long don't bother me as long as there's communication between the customer and the seller then i always think that there shouldn't be a problem so on the front she's got her Revel Soul badge here which I absolutely adore because they're my colours. Then you've got Spooky Post, I think that may be Violet Moth and then I've loads of these stuck around my house and it says delivered by your local ghosty. Love it, Zach loves the ghosty badge. I'm going to be ordering some stuff from Violet Moth. I don't know if it'll be any time this, this year now because Christmas is right up our backsides. It may be next year I will be getting from probably about 30 to 40 companies. So watch out for me. That's if I don't get to 1K. Do you know what I mean? I'm still trying to get there. So let's have a look, see what Amy's put in there. I know what mine looks like. Oh, and there's a note in there. <laughs> oh, oh, it's put never trust the living. So that again oh and then rebel soul gothic and alternative gifts it says www.facebook.com slash uk rebel soul all one word and www.etsy.com slash uk slash shop slash rebel soul uk there you go mayful i will stick it all in the description box below guys you can go and check them out Amy is absolutely lovely, easy to talk to, lovely down to earth lady. Thank you, Amy, for this opportunity. She kind of beat me to it. I was like, she was next on my list along with somebody else, but she kind of beat me to it. And it says, thank you. And it's got this black tissue paper. And I just really want to do this gently and not, and not rip it off and then I rip it off. Oh! It says welcome to our crypt oh yeah I need some more signage in here guys actually a lot of my signage I'm putting in my bedroom because my bedroom's more gothy in here it's so bloody cold at the minute I'm just putting most of my my items upstairs oh my god Amy <gasps> oh so I'm getting way excited here's my first sign welcome to our crypt guys it's on um, acrylic really nice so it's like a matte acrylic here with this silver writing really nice feels really nice that guys and then here is the back so you can see it's a matte acrylic and you can see how it's shiny on the sides there really good solid piece that guys i will put that on my bedroom door on the outside my husband will be going oh not more signs <laughs> yeah <laughs> there's some more for now i'll put this here but i'm going to keep it here so we can retract back on it Thank you so much, Amy. I absolutely love my first item. Look what I'm coming to. Oh, I love it. Oh, this is so cute. Jack Skeleton decoration. Oh, I love him. He's going on my goddamn tree. I haven't got a Halloween tree, but you know what? All these decorations, I'm going to find a place for them and I'm going to just hook them everywhere. That is adorable he's going in my bedroom next to my jack definitely so it's a jack skeleton black acrylic again it's on the mat with the black and white stripy string <laughs> i love it i love it i wonder if i could turn that into a clip as well terrible mate anything with jack i'm just absolutely besotted by and i absolutely love what i'm seeing i can see my item Amy, I love these. <laughs> so that's my second item. Oh, she's fit so much in this little box. It's beyond me. So, oh my God, these are well cute. So here is mine and it's a, a little planchette, which I've got a thing about planchettes as well. I 
I'm still waiting to grab a couple of things from Chains and Charms that's got planchette on. I do have a planchette as well. So this says yes, no, Ouija, and it's got all the letters of the alphabet, all the numbers up to naught. It says goodbye. Now I've got a blanket upstairs from Killstar that's like this, and I've got a cushion, I think, as well. I just I thought this would go well in my bedroom because of that design that I've got there. It's better than I thought. I absolutely love this. So you've got your hole in there, and again, it's this matte. I like the matte guys, I actually do really like the matte, I do, I love it, I just like this whole collection, I can't wait, my husband's going to go mad when I say, nails please, <laughs> ding 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 ding, <laughs> when we move from this house it's going to look like we've had a pin board on our, on our bedroom wall because there's that many up there. My next item is the shiny acrylic and I absolutely love this, I wanted this, I think I might have marked, I think these are some of the signs I may have marked as wanting and that's how she's known. So this one says, hell was boring, <laughs> I love it. So that is my um, one, two, fourth item, I can't believe she's put this much in here, naughty, I only got, they only got this, she's so naughty. So that is my fourth item, I absolutely love that. I don't know how they do these things, they're etched in, it's just like, I don't know what this is here, I think she's put me a print in. I've got a thing about prints and I've just bought a frame that this is going to go in, it's one of the frames that's here, <gasps> yes it is, oh and I marked this as, as one of my items that I wanted, so here's my print and it says the moon, <gasps> I love it, I absolutely love it, I love this, I needed this. This is amazing. Now, this is really thick card, guys. Um, the frame that I'm going to put it in, I'm just going to give you an example of my sprog <laughs> in a frame. This is my youngest girl, Leah, and I have changed the frame she was in because I've put Trevor in the frame that she was in because I just thought it was more like perfect for him. And I've put her in the gothic frame, but this will go nicely in this kind of frame, and I've got two of these. So that can go in there. Thank you, Amy, absolutely love it. And it's the moon. I think it may have to go up on my unit here with the others. Um, but these frames are really good, guys. Um, two pound, I think they are from B&M for two or something like that. So there you go. So it's a very thick card as well, guys. It's probably it's the same kind of thickness that I got with um, Marcus Jones same kind of thickness ah don't fix my print i don't want to take it out of the bag and get it dirty guys but this is going straight in the frame anyway but as you can see it's a quite a thick card mm, i love the smell of printed paper and that is my last item that she gave me for my um my pr amy thank you so so much it's the first time i've ever tried um amy store and do you know what? It won't be the last time I try Rebel. So guys, I can't get that back in now and I don't want to rip it. Ugh! Right, I'm going to put it on there. Guys, I will link Amy's shop in the description box below. And she had it parceled in this really nice box as well, guys. And it was all wrapped up with bubble wrap and everything. So first is the print. Then my acrylic star on the shiny acrylic that says hell was boring. I will be putting this up on my wall, just under my shelf. The Ouija one is what I purchased, guys. I can't remember if it was maybe six pound or something like that. I know it only came to eight pound in total. So that was that and I absolutely love that. So thank you, Amy, absolutely love it. I think my favourite has got to be this dude, obviously. I absolutely love my Jack. I wasn't expecting to see Jack in there. And I, I don't know if I actually seen Jack on there. So maybe she's done this especially because she knows I love Jack. So mwah, thank you, Amy. I absolutely love it. And then my sign, welcome to our crit. <laughs> I'd put that on my actual door in the porch, but I'd be scared of someone nicking off with it because it is really, really nice. Good quality acrylic guys as you can see it's really really thick it's not bendy or anything like that very good solid acrylic same with the jack i think it's probably the same kind of depth same thickness and same with the um the ouija the star is a little bit more thicker guys but again it's it's a different acrylic that's more of the shiny acrylic 
I absolutely love this. Absolutely love and I didn't expect I didn't expect half of the stuff that she's put in here. So Amy, thank you so very, very much. I just wish I had a big book of stamps so I could just write thank you cards to every single person. I think for Christmas you'll all be getting a card, especially from me and Sack, without a doubt. So that is Rebel Soul, guys. That is her card. I will put all the information in the description box below. I'm just going to read her little note. <coughs> Hopefully there's nothing in here that shouldn't be in here. So she put, hi, lovely. Thank you again for ordering and doing a review for me. You are a true superstar. I'm not sure what to say about me, but I rebranded to Rebel Soul a few years ago now. I have a few health issues and with the kids, it's easy to work around it. It's easier to work around them. I can totally understand why Amy does that as I don't work as a business. I mean, this is not a job to me. It's a hobby, but if it ever came anything more, that would be perfect. But as you know, I am, I am disabled. I am struck off from working for, I'm not even gonna go down that road, but Zach is homeschooled. So between the two of us, we work well together and my husband works from home as well. So the three of us are just under each other's feet all the time but we work around that so i can understand why she does that she says i got adopted into alternative market about a, about a year ago and things have never been busier the alternative goth community is amazing support for small businesses due i can hear my little sausage so give me a minute due Due to COVID, my products have changed slightly, but I'm making it work as best as I can. Amy, I think COVID or not, I think what you do is absolutely amazing. I hope you're well and thank you again, Amy. Three kisses. Oh, So I can understand COVID has affected a lot of small independent businesses at the minute. And I can totally understand why. But this is why I say, guys, I would rather put my money in these businesses than the higher end companies. Don't get me wrong. I've dipped into TK Maxx this year and I've dipped into... Um, Penland and home bargains but they're all affordable but anything that's higher end that's completely off the scale and you don't get the same customer service you don't get the same packaging you just don't get what you get with small businesses and that's why i always say to you guys please go and support these businesses because these guys they really do um appreciate it a lot more that i can tell you so amy i appreciate what you've done for me today and thank you very much and i hope this review serves you and your business because amazing i love what you do and i keep all my notes i've got so many notes from all you amazing people um if i ever had to give up doing youtube i think i would absolutely sob my eyes out because you're all amazing all right guys that's my cue to go because zach is now downstairs and he's not going to ruin Amy's review. So take care, guys. Mwah, mwah. Thank you, Amy. Go and check out Rebel Soul, guys. Everything will be in the link box down below. Um, and check out any of the pictures that I've put on in between. All right, guys, take care of yourself. I'm off to put my little frames and my little pictures up. And um, I'll report how bad I got shouted at of my husband for putting nails in the wall. All right, guys, take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Go and check out Rebel Soul, guys. Alternative Market, 30th, 31st of October, 7 p.m. Go be there. I think Amy will be there too. So go and check it out. You get things a little bit cheaper than the usual. I think she's super affordable anyway, guys. Super affordable. All right, guys, take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and hit that like button if you like this video it helps me out and my channel. Take care guys and I'll see you on my next one. Bye for now.